So what was your relationship like with your mom like growing up? Were you one of those kids that did slime in the dog's hair? My mom let me do quite a bit of things, but my mom okay. also had a radical sense of humor. Like okay. an incredible sense of humor. Like she, I remember, she knows I love animals, so when I was in college, she sent me a box that had holes punched in it. Yeah. She, and in college, and she said, I found you a pet you could, in the mail, you could keep in your dorm room. I hope it survived on the food and water. And it was a dead lizard that she had found in the backyard and was like, this will be funny to send to my daughter. <laughs> She also oh once bought me a taxidermied alligator from um, like a garage sale and sent it to me in the mail. I love And your... she would go around. This kind of explains how you found your partner in life as well. A little well. bit, a little bit. She <laughs> oh would, um, I got two more zingers for you. She would go around the neighborhood and collect cicada shells, you know cicadas. Yeah, yeah. She, but she would put them in a cookie tin and then send them to me in college and be like, Christmas cookies, but it was just dead cicada shells. What? And one time when I was in high school, what? she bribed, she was a cardiologist nurse, she bribed like the mortician uh, uh, to let her borrow three human hearts and brought them into my science class. Pretty sure that's illegal. Pretty sure that's, I don't know. Well, if you can prove it, Kelly, can, because <laughs> I had nothing that, to do with your it. Your mother yeah, is she's rad. awesome. She's rad. Oh my she's God. She's got like a dark sense of humor, which is probably where I get my dark sense oh of humor. Oh my gosh, but she's, and she's, your attraction to it. Yeah. Yes, yes. Yeah. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. I, I love your mom.